Okay, so I'm on the uh, the mound here. Um, one hand, two hand, safely operating, but got the horizontal control with blade um, autos going on. And I'm just cruising along here, and the nose is just following the um, the toe and the slope. And um, it's going mint. And I've been using the offset feature as well um, on the flat, so going really well okay so I've just backed up um, and then I'm just going to demonstrate this feature here so this is the lane offset so you can see the red line there is my selected alignment um, but now I want to use horizontal control but um, work the next lane over so clicking that you can see it's moved over so if I put the blade into autos uh, and then I start operating the machine going forward and click the autos for steering you can see I'm just going to slow it down the systems um, I haven't steered this once so it's just grabbed me taken me over selected the line and now I'm following the line over um, so again um, fully controlled with the blade as well as the steering and I'm just going to follow along this um, this next lane, the next pass on this side slope. So, um, very nice feature. Um, you get the precise overlap, um, which is very valuable for compactors, but for the dozer here, for spreading um, on this side slope, which is hard to um, control just to make sure you get where you want to go, um, the steering helps a lot. So, yeah, all good. You can see there. So, yeah. Definitely try it guys, um, a lot of value. Okay, so now I'm on the bottom part of the slope um, and I want to actually go through and um, pick the toe from the bottom. I'll show you how to do that. So we've moved the lane over. Um, so we'll go back, uh, wrong way. So just hit that button there. Um, so that's selecting the line. You can see here in the cross section view, the, the red vertical line that's representative of the, uh, the alignment and then yeah so I've selected it we've got no offset from, from that so we're on that alignment um, we can put the blade into automatics we can um, move forward and then I'll hit the uh, auto key for steering it's gonna move me onto it um, and now you can see here um, gonna just hold me on there I've angled the blade I might angle it a bit more just to shed the steer uh, the dirt and um, yeah hands free safely uh, so we're just gonna go through here it's gonna pass right around the toe of this berm um, precisely onto that alignment uh, very easy to use uh, one less thing for you as an operator to have to worry about um, so you've got the machine taking care of play, uh, grade and then also it can keep you on um, your alignment and then you can easily offset um, to keep using that feature. Okay so I've decided to give you some bonus footage so you can see here where I've come through the toe um, there's a bit of a windrow there that I want to get rid of and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the dozer to steer to um, the next lane over um, just to make it look nice um, and show you the, the control so here again um, we're still set up for the toe um, of where the pad hits the slope um, we'll just go and um, wrong way again <laughs> I need to learn um, you can see I've moved it over I'm gonna have to change the um, focus point so you can see now that the red dot there is close to it so if I start um, moving forward and then um, doing autos, the system's going to automatically uh, move me over to the line. It's going to rotate the blade a little bit more that way. And yeah, so now we're um, we're going. Um, I'll go back in a second, but yeah, we'll just sit here. You can see we're just chugging along here, following that line. 
Um, got precise steering uh, at a set overlap. Um, it's all configurable. And yeah, I'll go a bit faster. So we're just gonna cruise along here. Uh, yeah, easy to use, guys. Guys, check your, check it out with your local SciTech. They'll uh, give you all the details that you need to know.